this is Orion6 again, coming to you with a, um, Slayer update. Basically, um, I have been a pretty newbie person with Slayer and haven't done it for a while, and so I decided to get it up from, basically, up to 85 is my goal, but at the moment, it is only 69. But at 69, I decided to make a, uh, Slayer update and sell all my items I had kept from level 55 to 69 Slayer. So I have a Slayer tab for this. I keep all of the items um, that I need for Slayer, for different tasks, and for eventually to stick together a Slayer Helm. And these are basically all of the items I have gotten from Slaying that I have kept from 55 to 69. Now this does not include some items such as blood runes, which I use daily, so um, I have not included them. I will include a a price total of all of the items that go into my other tabs that are everyday items. Um, yeah, so here it goes. I'm going to try and just basically sell as, about as much of this as I can. I uh, get a lot of rune bolts from when I get a dragon pass, Addy javelins, yes, I picked those up. Um, rune knives and all that. I get a lot of daggers and rune knight limbs from dragons, nails from dragons, bars from dragons. I don't remember where I got that from. A lot of rune helms from... Uh, Spectres. Oh, and another another thing, just so you know, I have I have also stuck my clue scroll rewards in here because uh, these are all the clue the clue uh, the clue scroll rewards I've gotten from Slayer, and I I think it's only fair that you um, include them in the price of Slayer because they were gotten from slaying. So it's basically you know Slayer um, rewards. Uh, yeah, so I get a lot of just really random items. If I have an extra space, I'll pick it up. Like, normally I wouldn't take a adamant, you know, square shield. But if I have an extra space at the end and I didn't bring, uh, I didn't bring high alks for it, then, you know, and basically I'm just, I'll just keep it. I mean, cash is cash. Unfortunately, that didn't sell. But I know, I I know that you know doing a, a uh, video like this is risky because I know a lot of the stuff isn't going to sell, especially Addy Jabs are not going to sell. I don't even know. I guess I have to just calculate at the end and put which items you know are junk items and I have to sell later. But I will get my money out of them. So really, I just like to say that. Slayer is a lot of fun. It you know it keeps you busy and is a great way to train. I do believe when you're training Slayer, well, for one, it is it's just it's a great way to train because um let's see, I believe you get about point three three extra experience experience per you know what you would normally get. So if you hit a 1, you would get normally, you know, 4 experience in, in, a, in a combat skill. But, you, I believe you get like an extra 3rd experience. So, it's kind of nice. Plus, basically one of the great ways, the great things of uh, Slayer is that... Um, is that you have a Slayer helmet, which is just a great way, it's a great money maker. I mean, money maker, what am I talking about? It's a great uh, way to train because it gives those extra bonuses for your Slayer monster task. And it's basically, you know, almost like Armored Zombies is, is, a, is a great way to train. So I might cut the bit off 
hear probably commentary and just speed up my clip about all of these uh, items and then give my uh, total at the end and that's about it so thank you for watching